Hey guys, welcome to my Let's Play in Starbound. Let's get this full screen. And the reason why you had to see my uh, little browser bar down there. Um, well, apparently this game doesn't like to be recorded. So I had to do this stupid workaround. Yay! Anyway, let's get started. I, I love playing this game. It's so, it's so much fun. And, <clears throat> let's see, we have seven races to play as. Let's see, we can play as uh, humans. Meh. Despite their long term history, humans to possess a light hearted optimism out towards life and the universe. The community has set out forming a society that would unite the people of the universe. The Terran Protectorate. Avians are a race of colorful bird folk whose tribal culture revolves around the worship of Kulex, the winged god of the Aether. Their soldiers are trained from birth to be fierce warriors who will protect their temples at any cost. <coughs> Excuse me. Frog in my throat. throat. Um, um, Apex, a race of highly intelligent primates. For millennia, the Apex were close to their appearance until a scientific breakthrough allowed them to trade a physical devolution for intellectual evolution. Uh, Florins, don't be fooled by their peaceful appearance. Florins are known throughout the universe to be aggressive, carnivorous hunters, particularly inventive on their own, they're fond of stealing and adapting technology from people they've attacked. Yeah, I, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, but... Peaceful Hyloth place great value on ancestral tradition and take great comfort in the arts. Originally dwelling on land, their passive nature made them easy prey for the flora, and they were driven beneath the waves, where they now thrive. Glitch. The Glitch were built in order to s simulate a civilization, a fault in their programming caused them to become stuck in, stuck, stuck early in the simulation, and to this day, they are unable to shake their medieval values and beliefs. <laughs> and the Nova Kids, mysterious race of interstellar gas bang people. They have no charted settlements, no documented history. They're vile, volatile beings untroubled by the past. No one knows what they're made of, much less where they came from. Let's see, what should we play as? Uh, ape version 1, ape version 2, bird, plant, I think that's a frog, robot, or energy being. Oh, well, obviously we play that. And let's see, should I go with survival or casual? Survival, casual, or hardcore? Well, on survival, you need food, so... This is... I'm just going to show you guys how to properly you know, do this. Well, no death penalty, except you lose 10% of pixels. Which
trying to make Han Solo, okay? Stop doing that. Whatever you're doing, Chewie, stop it. Chewie's the cat that lives with me. Knock it off. Get out of here. Come on, get, get. <sighs> now that we're done with the character customization, we should be. let's play a feat. That personality, that hair, yeah, a nice little bouffant coif. Bouffant. <laughs> Let's get started, shall we? Oh, right, forgot about that. These are my other characters. Glitch and... Why do they look different? Oh, because. Enough. I am awake. I slept in my clothes? Damn it. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Enjoy that, alright. Little girl. Toys. Gotta get going. Okay, if you want to talk to people, you press E. Press E. This is, okay, mining, he has R, uh, 
um, wiring is T, inspecting objects, which will be very important for this game, is N. And Y is for paint. Allows you to look elsewhere. The draw distance will increase significantly upon. Ow. Ah, Let's see. We can buy stuff. We can buy a bottle of water, uh, a soda, or uh, a lemonade. If we had 60, we could buy a chocolate, cho chocolate, but I don't know, so let's keep going. Oh, wait. Okay, these flags represent each species. Yeah, a little unfair that the Nova Kid don't have one. But then again, they were a Kickstarter. So, yay. Uh, look at all that. <laughs> Frustrator knife. <laughs> like I'm a machine or something. You're a glitch. You're a First cosmetic item. Yeah, I got me a flower. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm cutting it late. Eat, um, future reference, these cutscenes, there is no way to, um, skip them. I think some of the people in the crowd are either, were either fun, people who funded the game, or helped make it. There is no way to skip those cutscenes when you see them.
as it can. I missed this so many times in my games. I just walked past that. Here is a hint. Do not, do not, for whatever reason, sell this sword. Sell it, trash it, do not do it. It will become very important later on. And I really wish there was a, you know, a quick, like, hey, press R, take everything. And here's our ship. Now there are two ways you can upgrade your ship. Way one, you find upgrade my tools and find upgrade modules and uh, huh. rebooting. I am sale. Your ship based artificial intelligence lattice. Uh, program blah, 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 blah. Okay, Earth was attacked by an enemy force and then was subsequent. Okay, so Earth is gone. Okay, we are damaged. Sweet, reward bag. We have no missions. This is an airlock. Ah, here we are. I like to put my, my medical supplies here. Food and other stuff goes. Lighting goes there. Food. And food. Food is a healing item. It's not a very good one, but it's a healing item. And our goal now is to explore this new planet that we have. Oh, sweet. Cotton. Yes, we're going to need cotton. We need to pick some cotton. Copper. Don't worry, this thing gets way better as, as you upgrade it. So you upgrade it, I'll show you in a few seconds. It's cold. Okay, upgrade your matter manipulator. Click here. You have the numbers of these. I would suggest upgrading power generation first, then optics. The expansion slots, you. I would suggest getting at least liquids because you're going to need that for fuel. And this, you only really need up to um, level two because that'll increase it by 4x4. Four 5x5 four. Five five is a little too big in my opinion, but, eh. Let's see, um... You definitely want to upgrade all of these first. You want to upgrade power generation, then optics. So the expansion slots you can just upgrade immediately. Um... Although they will help you in finding traps, so power generation, it helps you mine faster. Yep, we're gonna need wood too, because that's how every type of this game works out too. Power generation will allow you to mine and cut wood faster. Things to avoid.
lot of wood. are good. Petal plants are good. Uh, pixels are the money. Um, if you're playing survival, get every type of plant you run across. Bottles, thats those are always filled with pixels, but they're usually owned. Oh, we should really take this bag, too. There we go. Blue sleeping bag. Why am I collecting all this cobblestone? Because all this stone? Because I'm gonna need it for something. You'll see pretty soon. Oh, huh, what's this all about? This is the tr teleporter. Nice game to pay the money and reduce. Oh, this archaic energy source. Alright. One, two. roots? Cut them down. Every time you see them, cut them down. Because you'll need the plant fibers in order to make, you know, healing items like the salve and the bandage. Yep, more healing items. It's always good to have a lots, lots of plant fiber because you literally... Oh, iron? Iron makes the first tier um, armor, so having lots of that is good. Oh, sweet! Now, the Nova Kid are different from the other races because, in fact, they don't have any melee capabilities. At all. By at all, I mean at all. Here's what I mean. Oh, yellow plants. Why am I gathering all these plants? Well, I'm going to sh can I show you. Go. Ah, yes, cotton. This cotton so important because. A lot of cotton in order to beat this game. Or a lot of pixels. Ow. That's what it is. Gotta eat that. Eating will restore HP a bit, although slowly. talking about? I'll show you. We get there. Oh, no 
chest. Sometimes you can find chests in those types of old buildings and towers. Are you friendly? Yeah, you're friendly. You guys aren't. Sweet graves. Yes, in this game, being a grave robber, although creepy, is good. I'll show you why. See that right there? Yeah. Just dig this out, you can... Yes! Some iron and a pickaxe. Uh, pickaxes, not really worth it in this game, really. Because you can't really make anything. foreground, like this, you left-click, you mind the background, you right-click. Same to act, same to do this spinny, sorty thingy. You do what I did. Good, we're gonna finally even out. Oh, and I am over time. I am way over time. I am sorry, everyone. We'll continue this game. Uh, this is going to be a side Let's Play that I'm gonna be doing. Um, and I will see you next time. Have fun!